Winter 3 Synchronizer offers very powerful synchronization options which are set for each individual user. For the dominant database there are two options. There's the option to make ACT the dominant database or to make Outlook the dominant database. What this means is if there are two records that have been modified in ACT and in Outlook this setting determines which record will win the update. So if ACT is dominant and the same record has been updated in both Outlook and ACT, the ACT modifications will win. On the other side, if Outlook is set as the dominant database and both records are modified, the Outlook modification will win and will overwrite the ACT modifications. We also offer, you can choose to synchronize all the contacts. So this means that synchro uh, synchronization between ACT and Outlook and Outlook to ACT. If you disable this, that indicates that only contacts from ACT will make it to Outlook. So you take, it's like putting a one-way conversion from ACT over to Outlook. If you enable, then you're enabling the synchronization back from Outlook. So you can add new Outlook contacts, update contacts, remove Outlook contacts, remove Act contact. Also, if you want to merge contacts, you can enable this. For the calendar, the same way. If, if it is disabled, that indicates that we only want to transfer data one way from Act over to Outlook, and we don't want to bring any data in. So it's a one-way conversion from Act to Outlook and we also provide all the options that you can exclude modifications as well as removal from the calendar. The tasks as well the same thing. 